Okay, I had just cooked some uh, hamburger patties in this grease. So I'm using that same grease. I threw in some onions, some garlic. Now I'm throwing in this can of Rotel Mild. So pretty much what we're doing is we're sauteing our veggies. We're making nopalitos, which is cooked up cactus. So we have thrown in our cactus. Cactus is very um, slimy. So we have to cook off the slime and, uh, you know, let it all come together. So what we do is we just continue to let this simmer, stir it around every now and then. You're trying to boil off the slime, the babas, and uh, once you boil it off, then you have a little grease left over that you start to kind of stir fry it a little bit. But they're looking very good. The nopalitos look very, very good. And what I'm doing with my nopalitos is that I'm going to add some... This is actually leftover pork from the other day. We're definitely coming down to the wire. I used salt and pepper to taste. Fresh onion, fresh garlic, and a can of Rotel. I also used hamburger grease that uh, was left over from some hamburger patties. I used this leftover pork because I didn't want to throw it out. And a whole jar of cactus nopales. This is the tender cactus nopalitos I used. Very delicious stuff. You have to cook down the, uh, the slime from the nopales and let the little bit of grease in there take over. And um, as you can see, look at this, look at that. So I know the idea of the slimy stuff, it's like aloe vera, but uh, it's not appealing, but this is looking very, very good. Warming up my tortillas, toasting them. But if I said before kids, don't ever give me a white tortilla. I want my tortilla toasted if you're gonna give it to me. If not, you can keep it. <laughs> Alrighty kids, there it is. Nopalitos with puerco or nopalitos with pork. Some nice Spanish rice. Couple of tortillas to choke it all down. My goodness gracious, will you look at that.